hi guys welcome to my channel how are you all doing so a while back i started a series on my channel called affordable tuesdays where as you can make out from the name i review affordable products on tuesdays so in this is the second episode in that series and in this episode i'm going to review two products from ponds so the two products that i'm going to review are called Pond Super Light Gel Oil Free Moisturizer and Pond Slight Moisturizer Non Oily and Fresh Feel. So first, I'm going to review the Pond's um, gel product. So as the product says that it's a super light gel and acts as an oil free moisturizer. And the best part about these products are that they're really, really affordable. I was surprised that this whole container was only for rupees two ninety nine. And it contains 147 gram of the product. So this is a skin gel which I used every day for the past um, two and a two or two and a half weeks to see how it fares. And to be honest, I'm so surprised. As you know that you know I uh, love using gels on my skin because my skin is combination and very thick moisturizers don't suit me a lot. I prefer using serums and light moisturizers or gel based moisturizers and moisturizers are really essential for your skin. So I'm always on the lookout for a daily use moisturizer that is going to work well. So the texture is very light, very easily blendable. It just absorbs into your skin very well and uh, more importantly it just gives you a non-greasy moisturized feel and the effect stays for four to five hours on me which is great especially i think this is great for people who have extremely oily skin you can use it during the winters and then you can top it off with a more moisturizing moisturizer if you have very dry skin or normal skin or you know even for oily skin if you have extremely oily skin you can just use it on its own and um, I mean I think this is a great moisturizer for summers because um, you need moisturizer throughout the year but then if you have really oily skin or combination skin what happens is that um, the regular moisturizers they just make your skin feel very heavy and it just weighs you down so i think it's great for that i think it is great value for money um i love how the container looks the only call that i'll say is that the container um is a jar like it's a jar so you have to dip your finger every time you want to use it so i think it's a bit unhygienic apart from that i think this is a great value for money product and so summing up Pons claims that this is a super light gel that acts as an oil free moisturizer and is going to give you a non-sticky glowing skin. Now when you apply it, it's non-sticky, it moisturizes your skin, stays for 4 to 5 hours, um, but there is no visible glow to be honest. Like if you apply a gel based product, it just makes your skin look a bit radiant, but that is just for, um, you know, 15-20 minutes after that the glow is gone. And more importantly, if you ask me if there is any long lasting effect of this gel, as per my usage for two and a half weeks, there is no long lasting glow on my skin or the moisturizing effect does not mm -hmm. stay. Um, so if you're looking for a moisturizer that is going to add glow to your skin or is going to have a long lasting effect, I don't think this is what it's going to do. But which is why I have said that this is a great moisturizer for everyday use. If you want something light, fresh, something that is going to make you feel, feel make your skin feel moisturized without burning your pocket and just going to give you a very hydrated, moisturized feel. Mm -hmm. And it contains hyaluronic acid and vitamin E, which is known to be very good for the skin. However, if you're a lot like if your skin is very sensitive and mm -hmm. reacts to uh, chemical products like hyaluronic acid then you should still clear away from it otherwise it's really great the second product that i'm going to review is called pons light moisturizer non-oily fresh feel for soft glowing skin and it contains vitamin e and glycerin now this 
costs rupees 199 so which is even cheaper however this i bought it because as i said that i don't like very thick moisturizer that is going to make my skin really moisturized instead i like moisturizers that are going to feel light which is what these claim and especially for us who are from tropical countries um, that is what we are always looking out for if you are going out in the heat and the winters hardly stay for long. So, um, however, this is a product that really did not work for me. I will say why. So, when you apply this, it gives you a mattifying finish. But it does not serve the purpose of making your skin soft or glowing or feeling moisturized you know I mean when you use this your skin feels a lot moisturized but when you use this it just gives you a very mattifying um, primer sort of an effect so I really don't know I mean if you claim to be a moisturizer then it does not do its job that's all that I have to say about it so if you're going to spend 200 rupees on this I don't think it's not going to do, do much and um, the gel smells really well However, uh, this smells very nice but the smell is really strong which is also something that I don't really like. However, the gel it feels so fresh and nice. So I think you can skip this product but if there is one product that you want to buy between these two that I have just reviewed, uh, you know which one to go for. I'm going to leave that link down below and um, as for this one, um, skip it. So until my next affordable Tuesday video, I hope you liked this quick review of uh, these two products. If you did, please subscribe to my channel, leave a comment down below. Let me know what product you want me to review next. I'll see you